All right, cool. Welcome back. Let's get the game going. Whoa. I have a sandwich. Yippee! Oh, I found Jason. Ooh, sandwich. Why oh, do you have a finally. sword on my borders? What are you doing, buddy? Why wouldn't he? Your One swordsman could ruin you. Oh, yeah. that swordsman is just a, a dude who is told to uh, just. I all I just have him there. doing is just. Um, Standing there menacingly. No, he's. I auto set explore. him to auto explore because I could finally explore. Oh. I like to explore manually. Call me weird, but I do. I I will explore yeah. manually up into a point until I eventually get bo too bored or or like it's too menial to do it. But the game can continue to wait on me. I have other stuff I'm doing. But Mon and I have negotiated open borders so that his scout can Yeah, so that escape. my scout doesn't get trapped. You'll also notice that my capital, uh, Beaver Bay, has a bit of a harbor thing on a lake. But then there's a canal through Goose Crossing. I don't see what you see. Ah. I actually didn't see that far. It doesn't matter. There's a small lake there. Please to accept my gifts, a crystal vase, wine, truffles, and a dozen troubadours to enliven your court. Yeah, sure, that sounds fantastic. Thank you, Tex, that's amazing. Hey Jason, how do you feel about letting my scout go through your territory for the sole purpose of exploring? I'll do an open an open borders trade with you. That seems acceptable. Proposed. Tax, I'm willing to trade uh, luxury resources with you, except that's currently my only source of amber. So that's fair. I need you to sweeten the deal for me a little bit. I I've, got you. I I've got made you. a counter proposal. That seems fine. Diplomacy. Ooh. Uh, you know what? We're we're good for now. Ah, hello, Rajville. Enjoy the patronage of my dog-bearing scouts. Amusingly, when we puppy sat, Raj was okay with Maggie. So he would. He'd be like, yeah, the dog's all right. Duke gets, <laughs> Duke gets super jealous. I Eel. have avoided a dark age. I wonder if well, I can... there's still ten to fifteen more turns. I mm. so you might get to golden. I wouldn't mind. What can we use this samurai?
sandwiches are good, but toasted sandwiches are so much better. Toasted sandwiches are pretty good. Especially if you get it to the point where the salami crisps up just the tiniest bit. Oh, crisp on the salami is great. Mm -hmm. You get that little crunch without it being like charcoal. Yeah. It helped that when I bought the salami, they charged me. They charged me less than the the uh, display said they were going to charge me. They were going to be like, "Oh yeah, it's going to be eight twenty-five a pound for the salami," and it rang up at six a pound. So I was very happy. Nice. That's tr is that stealing or is that just the skill issue on their part? I actually brought I mean, it up to them. I'm like, hey, that says 825 on the sign, but it only rang up at 6. And they're like, okay, thank you. Keep it at that price. And I'm like, okay. Yeah, usually if there's a discrepancy between the ring up price and the list price, it's usually the lower price that gets given. Yay! I built a really big library! Yay! Make a really, really, really big library. the youth in these orders this guy look at all this rice rice and rice and rice and rice i have three rice tiles around kill this i gained five arrow points this turn alone which feels pretty good nice jeez what'd you do five uh more finished building uh, finished building a wonder and adopted a monarchy. Nice. I'm gonna go here and you're going to annex this tile because then that means I just get it for free and get 30 gold for doing so, which is kinda hype, and I can do that again next turn. I'm gonna be a minute because I actually have like the I have the means to do some shit for once. All right, take your time. Take your time. So. Ain't no rush. That's a builder, and then I guess. Rajville is not dominant in being a cat. <laughs> I have done nothing to influence this. This is just an observation. <laughs> Immediately buys missionary in Rajville. Mm -hmm. <laughs> sure, I'll do it. When even Raj doesn't know that he's a cat. I've met a representative of the Baloney <laughs> City State. Baloney City State wants me to convert them to my religion. 
I have been warned. What does you that mean? Who? Who? It means you converted one of my cities and I didn't appreciate it. Uh, so, I, so I asked you, please don't convert my cities. Or if you do, it generates grievances, which makes it easier for me to declare war. Like actual war. I might have too many builders. Nonsense. Yeah, you're right. There's no such thing. Yeah, seriously. Um... Especially not that I'm buying another settler with faith. God, I am expanding really freaking fast right now. Uh, I see your uh, swordsman r right next to my trader, my poor, poor trader. Hey, traders I'm not... can't. I'm traders scared. can only be attacked if you're at war with them. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess with. I'm not gonna mess with your traders. Don't worry. He's still a very scared boy. See well, okay, look, if a barbarian comes after the traitor, I'll kill the barbarian. Oh, I've already uh, turned all barbarian campments so far here into city-states. That's impressive. You didn't just destroy them? Why? Because I didn't have city-states near me. And there's yeah, and also, wanted... yeah, there's also the fact that that's going to be able to get him a lot of uh, diplomatic favor ballots. Oh, Oh, so there's more than just the initial nine city-states. Yes. So I haven't discovered them all. Correct. Because Tex has been making new ones. I have discovered ten city-states. Here, I thought I had all of them at nine. How little I knew. Amazing how the game works, isn't it? Oh, that feeling when you finish building a specific thing and it jumps up your gold income by like 30%. Nice. It is a what's your gold income well, what's it at? It's 20. <laughs> it's low. Uh, I'm always poor. Only 20. Only 20. Jason, I don't know how you how to tell you this. Who am I kidding? I totally know how to tell you this. Mine is 72. Cool. My 30s. I'm not kidding. This is not an exaggeration. I know. I always go I super hard. Anyway. In the economy. I'm just like, let's go gambling. And you're just like, let's be financially responsible. And I'm just like, oh, dang it. <laughs> oh, I have more culture than everyone else. Nice. Let's research. Yeah, I built a wonder. That's a big gamble, and it's not going to pay off, but we're going to go for it. Why do they have so many samurai? Wow, Tex, 47 culture per turn? That's very impressive. It's been the main thing I've been focusing on. 
I respect it. Oh, there's a camp over here. No wonder. No wonder they keep getting all these boats nearby. Yucky. Well, I definitely don't want that becoming a city state. Orders. I don't think I can buy anything with culture, though, can I? No. No, culture is up is only for research. It Answer means that you're, uh, yeah, it means that you're going through your civics much faster than the rest of us. Medieval era ends in ten turns. I just barely made it to Golden Era. <laughs> what? I could spend 66 turns trying to build the Petra in my desert city. It would do so fucking much, but it's 60 fucking six turns. Yeah. Fuck it, we ball. I probably add, I think I can add more prod if I, uh, God. With a trade route. I can't wait until two weeks from now when Mana Bender actually builds Petra in this game and pops the fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so ready for it. I'm so ready for Mana Bender to lose his fucking mind. I have faith in you, buddy. Seeing how Dukeville is also kind of on the desert, you could probably beat me to it very, very handily. And I would not know. Until, you know, you crushed my hopes and dreams. If I, but, want, you know, if I wanted to build it, I could do so in 23 turns. Yeah, I, my, uh, I do have a desert my path. desert city has three prods. Yeah. It would take me I mean, hours. I mean, oh, I am literally one era point away from being able to trigger a golden age. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll let's got, put it, let's put it this way, time. Mana Bender. I will not build Petra if you stop trying to convert my cities. Deal. <laughs> that I said, I am definitely going to have some yeah. trade routes sent from that from, from that city to uh, accelerate things a bit. Just one more prod will. Knock 16 turns off of that. Yeah, it's uh, kind yeah. of a big deal. The World Congress is meeting soon. Like, next turn, I think. Yep, that's going to be an exciting bit of... Oh! Your local Timmy's is over there by Mount... Mount... Roraima, yes. That. You're near it. You get to decide how it's pronounced. That's how this works. <laughs> And just on the other side of it is Walhart. Not to be confused with Walmart. Alright, time to begin voting. Time for the politics.
World Congress will reconvene once the remaining players have... Have, uh, decided. Yep, let's, uh... Let's see how that goes. Yay, boats. Yay, boats. Jesus! How they all really wanted harbors? Yes, I really want harbors because the upgrade for harbor becomes a lighthouse, and every lighthouse you have gives you plus one trade route. Therefore, lighthouses are very good. Way. Re yep. What do you need to research for that? Uh, lighthouses? That's just. Uh, circumnavigation. What's it called? It's super early in the tech tree. It's celestial navigation. Uh, it does not grant another. Wait. It gives you a trade route, which is an extra trader capacity. Oh, okay. So now you actually need a lighthouse instead of just a harbor to get a trade route. Yeah, we get a harbor and then you would build a uh, lighthouse on top of it. Okay. The mausoleum at Halicarnassus, huh, Noi? Good job. Yep. Man, I would love to build a new city, but there's literally nowhere for me to build it. <laughs> get on a boat. Yeah. If I build it too boat, far away, it's it hard to keep influence on it, though. Yeah, but if you build two or three close by to each other. True. No, it's official for the moment. I have too many workers. For the moment. That horse of yours needs to move, Lord. Uh, that is an unimproved tile that I wish to improve. I have already blocked it. It's already moved. It's. Uh, I can actually move it one space. Yeah. Hold on. The score is very interesting. Thank you. Monabender is well in front at 366. Texan is well behind what? at 205. And then... Lord's at 324, and Noi and I are both at 322. Huh. It is exceptionally close in the middle. Can we talk about... about Texas military might growth? Because in the past couple of turns, this dude has grown his military 50 whole percent. <laughs> Let's go. Amazing. To be fair, I'm about to build uh, a, a couple of naval u military units just to keep these fucking barbarians out of my coast. Oh my god, you're going to grow another 50%? Dude, you're going too fast. But what's really weird is that I'm fourth on culture despite making a fuck ton more culture than everyone else. Yeah, well, yeah, culture it's... alone is not how you win the culture. Yeah, yeah you need great yeah. work. Tourism. You yeah, need I have... tourism. You need great I work. Have... You need city walls. You need ice hockey rinks. I have, a lot of, uh, uh, I, have, I have a lot of great works. I just need to work on other things. Yeah. It's also national parks do a lot for it. What's your tourism per turn? Uh, it's six. Oh, no, sorry, no, it's 20. I have 23, yeah. so... I also have 23. Mostly just from city walls. Because that generates tourism. Yep. It's like that one episode of South Park. I've got this whole theme park to myself, and you can't come in here! <laughs> Zanzibar is upgrading to Spearman. Oh, man at arms. Okay, Zanzibar and Hunza. 
Medieval era ends in eight turns. Uh, build that plantation. Actually, speaking of growing things by 50%, I went from 20 gold per turn a few turns ago to 33 and a half gold per turn now. That feels pretty good, not gonna lie. Nice, nice. Um... Oh, I see your warrior monk going to Bologna, Jason. My warrior monks are just kind of bad at exploration. It's it's my missionary going to Bologna that you should be paying more attention to. Oh, I mean, I literally have a plus one point one religion a turn, or plus one one point one faith a turn. I don't, I don't care if you convert me. Oh, well, if that's the case, let me just, uh... Get the missionaries going! Let's go! Oh, actually, I'm headed to Bologna first, because I have a quest for them to convert them. And they'll give me a bonus envoy if I do. I may not be able to become suzerain, like, right off the bat, but... Yeah, I already have six uh, envoys in Bologna, so good luck. Yeah, I'm not going to be going for that. But I do want to have one so I can get the science bonus. Yeah, one envoy and everything is actually pretty fogged up. And what'd that say? Well, speaking of envoys... Crater heard something about France. It's really weird, because I didn't think France was in this. prod to that it's gonna go from 63 turns away to uh 38 you need to get that thing another trade router too Fancy wonder you got over there. Who? Jason. Oh, yeah. I just wandered into Silver Springs. Yeah, the uh, plus one culture and plus one science to all adjacent tiles is kind of nice. Ah, Politeville. Yep. That's Canadian if I've ever seen it. Sure is. There's Walhart. Surprised it's named that and not Valm, but you know, you do you. Finish selecting my policies. Do I have envoys available? I do. <laughs> oh shit! I have to select a research console. Uh, 
I had two of them available to play, so yeah, buddy. Barbarians need to get the hell out of Phoenicius. How many turns did it say it was the... Uh, six turns until the end of the era. Six-ish? Question no, it's, mark? It's six. It's six. You could click on it at the bottom and it tells you it's six. Oh, yeah. Sukanis and trade routes. I went from about 10 turns ago, it was 20 gold a turn, now it's 48.7. Nice. I'm putting in the work. Wow, and I'm only up to 77. You are. You are trying. Yep. I'm tired of being poor. Okay, that's something literally everyone can relate to. <laughs> okay, maybe not literally everyone, but you know, close enough. A, a lot of people can relate to. Uh, I like. I. I. I want more money. Hello, I like money. Yes. See, I ask about when the the thing happens because I have a wonder that is going to finish building on the exact turn that the era ends, and I wonder if that's going to count before or after. Uh, that's a good question. I don't know. Oh, that's Lord that I'm hearing clicking. Oh, am I just picking up the clicking? Yeah. Hmm. We can hear the clicks. Also, 51.6 gold now. Nice. Okay, I just realized if you, uh... If you zoom in on the uh, ice up at up at the north, you can see the Aurora Borealis. That would be nice at if I were in this time of day, this time of year. 
localized entirely within your Civ game? Yes! May I see it? Absolutely, if you scroll up there. <laughs> Let's see. God, I remember the spoof of that 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 showed me that was actually a meme. It was the um, it was the Battle Network one, and oh my god, it's so amazing. One of my favorite versions of that meme is uh, them doing it, but it's also a uh, Feel Good Ink. hell do I have the largest military? All right, uh, we're gonna make because, boats. Yeah, and I'm not building military units unless I need to take care of barbarians, really. I have finished building that thing that Jason probably wanted to build. Mahabodhi Temple? Yes. Fortunately, I'm working on a different temple. Great people. Another admiral. Yeah, I guess I am doing the whole boat thing. Oh, Minakshi Temple? Yep. And I will not try to build that because you will beat me to it. I'm four turns away, so yes. Yes, I will. <laughs> you what if will, I told you uh, I... You will have a bad time. What if I told you I could build it in three turns? I wouldn't believe you. Well, yeah, I can't. The, the timer's 22. And, th and this is in my high broad city. Oh, wait, Tim, that's not I, my I literally thing. have too many great people. I have a, a great writer and a great artist, but I don't have anything to put their great works in. It's so sad. <laughs> I, I got the so great sad. artist without actually having anything to put his great work in. And then I already have f five great pieces of writing, so I don't have anything to put the great writer in either. That is some very enthusiastic clicking. Yeah. Oh, I'm just I'm just mashing. Lord be going crazy over there. Lord, Lord's like, yo, let's go. <laughs> no, I'm just going mark is red, mark is red, mark is red. It's not let's go, it's ugh, emails. <laughs> Gochi's like, I'm here just in time to watch the stream end, and I'm like, nah, we we got time. Yeah, yeah we're probably only... going to turn a hundred if if the pattern keeps. This is sick. You know, I'm the not game. winning the diplomat. Oh, I'm not yeah, winning the diplomatic victory and anymore. It's, mm. And it's Saturday, so we might mm -hmm. do another part after this one, depending on the vibes. I would be okay with doing another one. I would too. Shit. <laughs> the joke was I'd be off work just in time to catch the end of the stream. Well, joke's on you. There's going to be like another at least hour and a half, two hours of this. See, this is... Jason, this is where you would need a, f um, a fake stream end screen. And just do a fake out. Yeah, that would be funny. 
Besides, Goji isn't Gorky. Yeah. Gorky shows up with, like, three seconds left. I'll just be like, all right, so see you next game. And then Gorky will be like, hi, did I make it? Nice to see you guys. I'm not going to be too upset if this one wonder doesn't count towards the golden era. Because I'll still be in a normal era, but I would really like to earn golden era. And I don't think anything else I have is going to finish in time. Also, Lord, sure we are picking up I'm we're picking clear. up whatever your fan is or whatnot going on in the background. Yes. Oh, that's just mm, I don't know why it's, that's just the computer fan. Oh. Uh, you I'll may want to turn mic, down your some. your mic sensitivity just a tiny bit. Medieval era ends in three turns. His PC is entering the space age with them turbines. <laughs> All right, I've lowered my mic sensitivity a bit. Let me know if the fan still uh, is audible. Nope. All right, good. World Congress has awarded me two diplomatic victory points. Why? Uh, because you voted with resolutions that passed. Huh. Yeah, that's how you get uh, diplomatic victory points. Glad that we could be suitable background noise. What am I gonna do with all these admirals? What about boats? They are boats. Yeah, but consider more boats. I would expect nothing less, Goji. Holy shit!
No, I just want you to know, trading with Yalise is going to give me 14 gold a turn. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing a bit of that. All right, so I have <laughs> achieved my golden age by using faith to attract the attention of a great writer. <laughs> I'm good with this. I'm very happy about it. Now I kind of hope that the uh, the the Minakashi, Minakshi Temple doesn't count for this era. I would love to get a three uh, head start for next era. Boy, someone finally discovered a second continent. Hey, oh. My era score is 69. Nice. I'm literally 53 out of 46 for era score. I am 70 out of 61. Ah, my warrior monks are finally getting on the move. Hooray! I've been telling almost all of my units to just go ahead and explore. Sea the Sea Ghost Clan is real close to becoming a city-state, so I sent them some money and they're like, here, have a boat, and I'm like, yeah! Honestly, I am I am very close to that city state. The sea actually, if I, yeah, uh, if, if I wanted to be a dick, I could uh, send a settler over to within three spaces of it and prevent that. You could. I'm not going to. I was about to say, but are you going to? One, two, three, four, five. I could have it done in like four turns. Because I can buy the settler right the fuck now. Power of money, huh? No, power of faith. Actually, I am going to, but I'm going to settle elsewhere, so don't worry about it. Anyway, unit needs orders. Uh, go up there. Go there. Um, let's buy a tile. Turn. One turn remaining in this era.
I got moved two units, and then so that's all my units that don't have free order and it moves. <laughs> I am a great person. Ah, another great merchant. Let's go. <clears throat> Why am I settling down there? That's such a bad idea. No, it's not. Yes, it is. <laughs> doing it anyway. Shut up, self. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I am arguing with myself. What of it? How goes the sieve? It's going. It's going pretty well. I've had two my sailing score, Go ahead. My score is way bit. below everyone else's. I've had two sailing scouts, and I feel like I've uncovered like a lot of the map. An astonishing amount of the map, even. I haven't found uh, Texas cities yet, but I've heard they're in the bottom left of the map. Yeah, I'm kind they're... of just on my own with a couple of city states that I made. And, uh, uh yeah. He's I'm just kind not of far background. from Jason. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm really literally just like across the river. Yeah, uh, you. Yeah, you're literally across the pond. Yeah, he's east of Jason. Just happens that all my explorey areas are. <laughs> We're all in a golden age. All on the other side. Amazing. The sea ghosts are. Giving my scouts problems. And I'm not a fan. Flowers surround me, alone with my drink. I pour for myself, no companion to join me. I raise my glass and toast the full moon. Mm. We shall. Mm, we shall lots of good trading with the elites. I have created my first great work, Drinking Alone by Moonlight, a writing great work, which gives me two culture and four tourism per turn. Wow, thanks to the power of trade routes. My desert city is now at 8 broad. 19 turns from Petra. We're getting there, baby. We might just get there tonight. I have access to six new city-state quests. Good lord. Scout was attacked by the barbarians. That's great.
So all of that stuff that I was working on, turns out that was this era instead of the previous era. So that gives me like a quarter of the way towards the next gold era. Oh, I'm the first major civilization to beat the Laventa city-state, so I got a envoy there. And that is one extra faith. Love it. Love it. Excellent. All right. Now I have 60 gazillion things to do. Oh, there's a new city-state just to myself. Ooh. Yuck. I can buy settlers, builders, and traders with frickin'... Get out of here, barbarians. Oh no, there's a dust storm over the uh the the sea ghost clan. Oh no. I don't really care. It's just there. <laughs> Guys, I have a problem. What's your problem? I've run out of Tellius nations to name my cities after. Oh no. At least ones that you know. True. I'm gonna need another game now. if there was any question. Oh my god. Crabs are goaded. <laughs> Name them after the notes of the famous song 4 minutes 33 seconds. Okay, I did. Fenris is like finish. If this th start adding numbers if now. the Saiyan Empire could have a Vegeta 7, you could rename cities with numbers. Goji's Wait, late. Crabs oh. are not goats. Crabs are crabs. So, uh... Mana, how many cities do you have? Eight now.
Crimea, Gallia, Binyan, Phoenicius, Dayan, Goldoa, Kilvis, and now Hoshido. I see. How many C's do you have? Me? I have three. I've just kind of spread out all across my initial landmass. You're just sending There's me over my and way, Mom. two city states here, and not a lot more space, except a fuck ton of desert. Uh, might I ask why you're sending an, an apostle this way? Why not? Because Jason gets mad when I send him his way. Why are you buying apostles instead of missionaries? I didn't buy them! I got them for free when I finished the wonder. And then evangelize your belief. Already done! Fenris is like Hoshido 2 Electric Boogaloo. Convert or get nuked. <laughs> I'm not Gandhi. Considered it, but I'm not Gandhi. Why did I buy another fucking scout? Where did this scout come from? Oh, probably a tribal village. There's Bordeaux. Why are you buying apostles at the missionary store? Why are you at soup? No, I made, I made Mahabodhi Temple. Don't worry, it's fine. Haha, -ha. Monabender, I've finally gotten ahead of you in faith production again. How much? Uh, 78.7. Did I tell him, guys? 79 flat. Oh, just give me a second. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay, so apparently building fishing boats automatically gives you all tiles adjacent to it. And that's kind of goaded. How much gold are you getting per turn, Mon, now? 139! Nice. I'm, I'm making 90. Oh, look, piece of candy. With a K. Go to the next house. It's just more apostles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I found three sales clan. Oh, is that the... That might be the one that I hate. Yep, it uh, is. It's I wanna... 10 plus turns away from city-state conversion. Yeah, I'm four turns away from getting gun. <laughs> and I will promptly introduce... So you're four turns away from crater conversion. Got it. And I will... And I will... I'd be very happy to introduce the three sales clan to the uh, front end of a rifle. <laughs> it's chosen violence. I'll be right back. I'm going to grab a drink. I have discovered the Matterhorn. <laughs> Goji, let's be religiously responsible. Ching, I can't stop converting. <laughs> Ching, I can't stop converting. Oh, uh, if you saw the Matterhorn, you're right next to my capital. I'm aware. I've been sending missionaries over there, my guy. Y'all, uh, you've been sending, you've been sending missionaries to Rowan. You haven't sent any to my capital. That's okay. Give it time. I'll fix that. 
Oh, there's a new city set of Chinguetti. Yay. Needs more amenities. Needs more settlers. What? No settlers. Oh, no, I have lots of settlers. You can never have too many settlers. Fine, I'll make a shipyard instead here. Could have made a settler instead, but I didn't. Let's put this guy. Oh, oh look, Chinguetti. The barbarians have decided to unbarbarize. Where should this set that go? They need to go down there for a while. They found religion. Oh, I need to hydrate. I've upgraded my boat into better boat. Oh, hi, Jason. Hey. Your your missionary is right next to my settler. Are you about to convert my new city? No, I'm about to convert that new city state. So what I'm hearing is you don't want to name my new city. I wasn't going to let you anyway. I Welcome didn't... to Nora, bitch. I, that's fine. <laughs> you have given you have given Nora a way better chance at life than Nintendo did. <laughs> I have a bunch of settlers going out right now. I've got like... Mana Bender right before he yeah, discovers like... Camilla loves seafood. <laughs> Kochi's like, Mana, quote that. What? There were like three quotable things that were just said. Yeah. Look, just type out the add quote command and I can copy paste it. Reroute. From where to where? The score has... Shift it again. Mana Bender 452. Oh. <laughs> you give Nora a better chance at life than Nintendo did. Yeah. There you go. Quote number 1634. As a reminder, at turn 100, we will call break, even though this episode has gone long. That's all right. Fine, we drink. almost finished building the harbor and Skedsmo. It's a good quote, Goji. Quote thirteen forty eight, back when Paula was very insistent on playing Catan with us all. <laughs> Give to me the two brick. Give it to me now. Okay, now you're all fucked. Sorry. <laughs> Aha! Candy now believes in Binyan. Oh, that's fascinating. Good job, Zanzibar. You get to live. <laughs> yeah, that was earlier today. I don't remember what Zan Zanzibar did to deserve to live, but uh, they sure did something. Uh, It was... Oh, yeah, the uh, unique bonus for being suzerain. Receive oh, the yeah. cinnamon and cloves luxury resources. These cannot be earned any other way in the game and provide six amenities each. Yeah. What? Yeah. What? 
Yeah, One it's. Moment. I'm I'm gonna need to become suzerain of that. Yeah, no, I will kill you. <laughs> yeah, you and what army? You you do see that my uh, military strength is ninety five greater than yours, right? Yeah, but can you buy warrior monks? Can you buy whatever the fuck you want because you're making one hundred thirty nine gold a turn? Not afraid of you. <laughs> Good, because I'm not very scary. Nora needs amenities. Production for Bandit Valley. Yeah, buddy. Um, One okay. safe convert to ice hockey. Canada. Yep, that's correct. That's, uh, 50 faiths yeah, for a Lord. builder. That's it? Yeah, Good I've been making Lord. builders really, really fast. I've also, okay. like, my past five settlers have also come from faith. That's why I have completely dominated my landmass so early. Okay, Jason, hear me out. Hear me out. I I need more culture, and I think you can benefit from culture. Basically means that we give culture whenever we're in trade. Sure, as long as you give me some uh, diplomatic power for it. <laughs> All right, Scout, you're going to auto explore. Uh, would you be fine with a little less than that? I'll do 12. Oh, we gotta wait for... Uh, serfdom, I think, Goji. Yeah, there is um, there there is a uh, government policy that gives builders plus two actions. The meta is to take it, hire like four builders, and then get rid of it, or just you know keep it forever. You know, you do you. Got an achievement for naming a unit. Name units. Yes, it is an achievement. They have to get two level ups. Uh, fucking five builds on a builder. That's so dumb. 
It's so stupid. I mean, I get four builds to a builder because of a, of a, I think pyramids. I'm going to be getting five for a while, so I'm going to make the most of that shit. See, I have met with Jerusalem. Jerusalem wants me to convert them. <laughs> Topical. All right, time to time to make that happen. Choose research. Is that more land I see over there. Uh, we'll get that done and over with. Yeah, that totally is. Let's buy another settler with faith. I can crank out almost a settler every two turns with faith if I wanted to. Incredible. That would be a horrible, horrible idea. Why well, you can never do it? Any settlers. What's your faith, Jen, Jason? 88.5. Oh, you're beating me by half a point. Dane, Mata has a ton of faith saved up, though. 700. Yeah, I don't know what to do with it. Buy I've been building a lot of, uh, I've been buying a lot of builders and shit. I'll just convert myself back, Goji. Okay, well, I would need land to settle for that, and I don't see a lot around me. If you saw what I saw, you'd understand. I've been doing that! All over the place. I wonder if anybody else find my named unit. Yes, I know the game's waiting on me. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, usually it's waiting on me. Uh, hey, congrats, Mono. You finally got some iron. I've had a single source. Um, I'm very slowly upgrading my warriors. My volcano went off. Oh no. Nah, it's perfectly fine by me. Alright, now let's go choose this barbarian the power of gun. Let's see. 
I think what'll happen is when we break here at turn 100, when we come back, we'll probably go to 120 instead of 125. Because the turns are getting notably longer. Yes. Ten turns to Petra. New barbarian outpost. I've met a representative of Hong Kong. No! Hong Kong wants me to convert them. I want to declare war on them, but I'm not allowed. Well, I met Hong Kong first, so I got an envoy yeah, bonus. I will not be allowing them to expand their borders. Damn, it still said 10 plus turns. Huh. Nice lie game. It is not appreciated. Such a good, bad, good idea. Well, self, which is it? Now I'm up to 85.8 gold a turn. Nice. 154.4. Sorry, not sorry. Yeah, well. Still, more than a 400% increase from when I started this episode is nothing to laugh at. <laughs> oh, wait, you were serious. Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not that mean. I was about to I was about to fucking denounce you, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I post yeah, I don't care. No important. I have a frigate. 
Gain 250 science on standard speed for each adjacent mountain tile? Galileo is fucking busted! Yeah, Galileo's pretty good. And I'm getting him and snuggle up to three of them. This is kind of a crazy idea, but it's not the craziest I've had. Yeah, great people really can make or break a run. You right, Goji. A lot of things can. So I can pick. I'm guessing it'll be 375 science for three mountains. Half of this turn is looking great. So yeah, I'll just look at that tech, activate it, and kaboom, it's researched! Huzzah! Well, Jason, you are right up against my borders. Yep. Hello there. Oh, yeah. Hi, how's it going? As I'm one I'm one culture per turn from greatness. Oh no. Lord figured out what I did. Yes. You, you see the, uh, you got the, uh, the notice in the mail? Perhaps. I will neither confirm nor deny the receipt of said notice. As soon as 
Noi is done with her turn, that'll be the end of the episode. All right. Okay, that is that is it for episode three of the return, and the overall score, uh, another Texan last place at two seventy eight. Then moving up, we have Lord of Fail at four thirteen. I'm at four twenty two. Noise at four thirty two, and Mana Bender is well out in front at five eleven. We have a clear leader, a clear unleader. And second through fourth is quite the battlefield. There's the person in first, the person in last. I'm realizing very really quick that uh, culture is pretty hard, <laughs> especially when I spawn next to basically no one. Oh, culture uh, victory is going to be hard. Yeah. Yep. Especially in a game with Canada, because at a certain point when I unlock the Mountie, I will just start crapping out national parks everywhere. <laughs> and you might victory. want to see a doctor about that. I'm yeah, going for the get trade parks, victory. You need to get a, uh, a naturalist, which is a faith unit. But Mount is just a regular production unit and can make double natural parks. And it gets combat bonuses near them. Congratulations on quote 1635. <laughs> <laughs>